Hey guys, it's time for the best stage, the Ruined Zoo! Wow, what a great... I have a bit of a story, but not really. Basically, I was playing the stage with Toby. It took us about like an hour to beat. This one's not that hard. But, like, honestly, when I was playing by myself, it was pretty hard for me. It took me a really long time to beat. I was it didn't take me a long time. I was always at constant, like, I constantly had high percents and like, the porky chase is just annoying. You just don't fight anything. You just gotta kind of jump over it. Yeah, it's pretty boring. That's why basically you and Mario, it's like, am I actually gonna fight these enemies? No. Oh God. Yeah. And like, Lucas seems so useless in this. It's, it kind of hurts. You mean Lucas main? It, it, it hurts you. Nick, did you come back in? Wait. Oh, yeah. I'm always in default. No, I'm sorry, I'm not defaulted, but like after I've been in, I stay in. Oh, okay, here we but, go. But I need to get my name back. You're Klaus. Eventually, I will. I Eventually. Will get my name back. Oh, he has a stick. Yeah. Lucas is one, it's just a straight up Klaus Ness, I will say. They could have done, so, done so much with this new stuff, but they didn't. I mean, he's better than Ness, though. Yeah, he is. No, I, I, I'm, I'm just better with Ness in general. Lucas is a better character, though. Yeah, I will admit, Lucas is better in his own right. But sometimes... Ness is too fast and his attacks aren't as, as good. The reason why I don't like uh, Lucas is because the only time I ever heard of him before... Uh, well, only I've got Mother 3 localized, though. The only time I heard of him was uh, in Subspace Emissary, and he seemed like a total baby, so that's why I don't like him. Yep. They, they didn't do his character justice in the subspace. And it, and it just didn't really leave a good taste in my mouth for the rest of the times. I know he's pretty cool and all, but I just find to come Ness better. And they they kind of just made Ness seem so much cooler. They, they, they did do justice in subspace, okay? And then when you, and then when you go back and kind of research, it kind of puts it all out of context, you know? But I understand. I, it's just I got used to Ness more than I did Lucas because I'm good with Ness. I want another three localized. No, get out. Okay, he drowned. That's no, he didn't. He's going back. Get out, get out. He's going back. He's gonna just yeah, he get out. That's that just. The stage sucks. Can we just? Or, oh no. Oh! oh! That timing though. Lucas and Klaus are just running. His shoes are untied. Wow. No, no he got caught somehow under there. Even though his whole foot is under there, and he when he he got caught when he ran under. Wait, Lucas can use PK Thunder. Why couldn't we have just done that? I'm Ness, by the way. Fine. Ness is so much cooler. He's really not. Wait, I'm wearing a sideways hat. He's such a thug. Joey. But in your opinion, should Mother Three be localized? Yes. It's gotta happen, don't you think? There's such fan demand. Oh, but you remember E3, oh, um, what's it called? Oh, yeah. It's not gonna happen! Ready, give us Mother 3! Red Boom! Fan. Yeah, I mean, like... Yeah. I think they're probably actually developing it now, but, you know, there's so much text in the game, like, that's taking a while to do. And also, it's just... They're kind of just waiting on it. Well, they just did Earthbound Beginnings, so I'd say that's next. What does Earthbound Beginnings even contain? Mother. Just Mother? Does it contain Mother too? No. So they renamed it to Earthbound Beginnings, so maybe they'll rename Mother 3. They'll, they'll probably rename Mother 3 to Earthbound 2. Yeah. And maybe, and then that would leave a possibility to make a third Mother. You mean a fourth one. Well, we'll quote unquote third mother. I think the next one will probably have worldwide release. Yep, hopefully. You know, sometimes when we're just like doing this, I kind of forget that we're recording. Oh! Did you see that? I was just, la I just landed on top of it because I still had invincibility frames. Oh, grab trophy, grab trophy! Did you see that sweet juke when I hit him? And I killed him? Yeah, that was me, bro. I can say it's Lucas from whole level, right? Yeah, I'm gonna be Pekka and Lum Trina. I, Wait, um, why is Wario here? Don't remember that. He's the one who sent that. Boom! Hi, Wario. Thanks for coming. It takes time to charge that, so you can't like do that. Ness. 
sacrifice herself for Oh look. You could have saved Lucas. In the beginning, Lucas is an idiot. Like honestly, the Pokemon Tree and Lucas storyline, what do you think of it? It's okay. I personally like it. In my opinion, it just kind of it just kind of dark. In my opinion, the Diddy Kong and no, no, he's like, oh, okay. The Diddy Kong and Santa storylines are kind of the worst. Yeah, I love the Ike and Marth ones. Those are pretty cool. Yeah, the Ike Marth, Midnight. the Med the Midnight storylines. Yeah, any of those those are cool. All Midnights are great. Don't don't oh, sorry. And then oh, look at me, I'm so cool. Like. The Pit, Link, Yoshi, Mario storyline. That's the best. It's okay. No, that's my favorite. This one's per my personal favorite. My personal favorite is the Link, Mario, Yoshi, Pit. Whatever it is. That's just like, in my opinion, that's that summed up Subspace Emissary when they had that, the five of them line up. Yeah, but that, that is like the top shot. I like, mean, it, I'll, I'll agree with you. Th they're the most iconic characters for Subspace, like... It's probably the most iconic storyline, but this one I feel has the most story in it. Yeah, the Luigi and Ness storyline is, it's, the Luigi and Ness storyline kind of sucks. Yeah, it's like, it's like, so Luigi, Ness, and Deity appear for the last level. That's the only time you get to play as a, aside from the Great Maze. That's like, really now? Really? Yeah, but Men that actually has some of the best storylines. What like, if they add between those characters in last? Hold on, just quickly. Let's see, Joey. See, Senor. Midnight actually has some of the best storylines because he's got yeah. what's it called? The Halberd. The, he's he's got like the whole Halberd thing with Snake. He has the climbing the mountain thing with the ice climbers and Lucario, and then he has the the whole thing with Marth and Ike for a while. And then some of the best shots are that one of the five iconics, the one where all the ships fly into oh, the that's, giant. Oh, that's that's the best. That is hands down best cutscene in the whole game, no question. And then the other one is when they all board the ships. Or when all the ships land and they all meet up. Yeah, like, those are the best shots in the game, no question. Oh, another... Oh, oh God, God. Another... Oh, 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 it's Flow for Progressive, look out! Another amazing shot, in my opinion, just quickly, yep. it, it's just the ending shot. After you beat the game, yes, everyone looking at down into the sunset. And then it's like an X where uh, the thing was. What? There's just an X where the black hole was. If we, if we, if we can call it. That. Oh God! You mean the subspace area? Oh. Wait, how they die? He's getting it. the flows are the worst. I hate, I hate progressive. Half the time, if I'm really high on percent, my strategy with the flows is just run. Okay, let's just go then. They follow you. Okay, you're not happy. 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 So, compared to Wii U, what do you think of this game? I say subspace is like... Just going Subspace! Back. Subspace, honestly. Make the story a bit longer. This could be a game on its own. Yeah. Nintendo's Heroes meeting up. That would be a perfectly fine game. I would play that. This is just the epitome of like video games, like right here. This is what it. This is what every video game should. This is what this is what crossover is, guys. Subspace Emissary is like the def is the best crossover I've ever seen. Like and Brawl, I feel it. it it's better than Wii U in some ways, but Wii, Wii U has a better roster and better graphics. But Brawl has like subspace. I like the lightness of Wii U, especially. Yeah, Wii U. It's more cartoony, which I like. I like the vibrance. Yeah, Brawl, it always looks a little dull to me. Wait, what? I can't fly with the golden hammer in this game? No. And there's no enemies for you to get. That sucks. Oh, you have to go in here, remember? Oh, yeah. I got stuck on there for so long. Didn't you? It took me a little while. But the only thing is, where's the door that we just came in through? Don't ask. That's all just nitpick, though. Oh! Oh God! The Brightons! Biton! Bitons! These guys are the worst in the Samus levels, though. Oh yeah, cause they and they're then, everywhere. The column just like there's like a there's like a corridor, and then it just gets filled, and all you see is a Biton. The worst are the, are these Biton rushes things, cause they can take forever. I just drowned. 
good for you. Sorry, we're gonna die. We're gonna lose. Well, if there was a stage to lose on, it should be this one. This is one of the hardest stages. In my opinion. One of the oh. saddest things is Joey. sometimes Squirtle can't. Joey? Glenn. What was in it? I'm not sure. Because you off screened me, so you might not have gotten the extra life that could have been in there. Tell us in the comments section below. Oh, yeah. Also, Sam and Caleb were constantly saying, guys, in the comment section below, say it's like, guys, dude, no, no one watches these videos. Honestly, no one does. We're doing this just kind of for us. Yeah, honestly. Hashtag what a self-esteem booster. Did you just trip on nothing? That's Hashtag my, random trip. That's my taunt. Oh, God, tripping in this game. Was there a problem for me, honestly? Yeah, I didn't even know. I it. never ran into tripping. That's a problem. I didn't. I, Don't eat the food, Joey. I didn't even know what it was. I didn't know it existed. I think that's like more of a problem for like the hardcore games. It's like you don't notice it. It's about one second delay at most. I need some of this. Oh, I thought it was you. No. I have the super high percent. No, I thought I, like I I thought I was playing as Lucas. Like I, I I wasn't talking about the percents. Ha ha ha. No, I mean I wasn't looking at. The Leave me alone. Okay. Well, at least we off screen that. What's his face? The, at least we off screen the progressive, so it won't come back. No, they actually have flow Halloween costumes. Guys, come on. Stick with State Farm. Get your cold cut. Yeah. Cold cuts. Ooh. No, that's Geico. Geico. Sorry. That's, that was just sad. Do you know what insurance company you use, Joey? No idea. I'm and pretty sure I use State Farm. Like a good neighbor. No, actually, wait, 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 grab him, grab Mr. Saturn. Can we do that? I think we can, but he's I, gone. I'm not going to risk it. Whoa, 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 Joey, we did it. Get taken. What? That collided right with him. Oh, whoops. That was a hard stage, honestly. That was pretty, a pretty gifted. Like, that, was a, that was a really hard stage, and I wasn't very good at Smash. <laughs> that wasn't extremely hard, but it was one of the hardest we played. But it's it's hard when you're not good. Mm -hmm. You know, we've had this going for about fifteen almost minutes. Yeah, after this stage, yeah. this is like the end. We normally do like one stage per episode. Stage player. So no. like we can upload a couple times a week. Yeah, this is we have a nice amount done. So guys, make sure to tune in next time. We're gonna be playing on. Oh, we got Lucas Battlefield Battle Fortress, Meta Knight Ike, and. Marth. Marth. Okay, see you guys next time. Bye.